Hello, Inside Two Hundred One. Today is not a regular lecture. Today, I want to talk about how the final grade will be cal calculated, and I'm going to give you more information about the final exam. It's almost the end of the semester. Um, you you must be very curious about this stuff, or worried about this stuff. Um, so let's talk about them. Um, so I'm going to do it this way. So uh, we have all the possible points here for the preparation. Two possible points: the in class exercise, five points each, and we have seven ones. So it would be thirty five, right? And for the reading quizzes, the total possible points is seven. Point five, and the response paper is twenty, and the final exam, the original one is thirty. By I made some adjust adjustment here because I don't want the final exam to to take a large proportion, so I changed the points. Now it's tw it's twenty. So all the possible points will be eighty four point five. So based on this, I made this table. If you are in this range, you are going to have an A. In this range, B. I make the range a little a little bit bigger. It's not like ninety percent would be A. It's like、uh, it would be like eighty eight percent would be A. And I make the range range a little bit bigger for your favor. Okay. Okay, and let's see. The final exam. So, um, twenty-one questions will be randomly selected from all the English exercises and the reading quizzes. So, all the material will be the material that you are familiar with. Okay, they will be they they will be identical. Okay, so you if you are doing well for the in class exercise and the reading quiz, then you will be doing well for the final exam. And uh, each quiz each question would have would be point five points. And um, in so we have twenty one questions, and the possible points will be twenty point five. However, the maximum points for the final exam is twenty. In other words,、uh, with this setting, you can make one mistake and still receive one hundred percent. Okay, and I'm working on preparing a study guide of the final exam. So before I open the final exam, you are going to have some study guide to.、Uh, To watch or to read for preparing the final exam, but actually all the material will be in the slides and the readings, which you are you are supposed to be familiar with them. Okay.、Um, okay, and for the response paper,、um, again twenty possible points for the response paper, and. I want to make sixteen sixteen points to be my bottom line, which means that、uh, if you are doing okay, you got all the formats and contents right, okay, then you are going to receive more than sixteen points. Okay.、Um, now we can have some estimation on what your final grade will be. So let's see what is left here.、Um, we still have the in class exercise seven point three. I'm still working on that. That would be two point five two point five points. And for the final set set A, set eight,、um, I I'm not going to have a regular in class as in class exercise. Instead, I'm going to make a bonus quiz for for set eight. Okay, and the final exam. If you are doing okay, if you make some mistake, you have like an eighty percent correct. Then you are going to receive sixteen points for the final exam. 
uh, for a response paper, if you're doing okay, you are going to have 16 points. In other words, um, you may receive 34.5 points or more for the for what are left, right? 12 plus this guy. And if you are going to do the bonus, you are going to have more. So let's see what your final grade will be. So if we are this person, um, 44 plus 34, then this would be 80, uh, 78, right? Then this guy would be A, right? And for for example, this person, um, if this person is going to receive 34 more points, then this person, the final points for this person would be 75. Again, it's an A. So, um, if you're in this category, if you are doing okay for the final exam and the final paper, then you are going to receive an A without any problem. Um, and if, if you're not in the category, you have to work a little bit harder for the final exam and the final paper in order to receive the receive an A. Okay. Uh, so let's say for for this explanation on the final exam and the final paper and the final grade. Okay. Um, and wait for me for the study guide for the final exam. And if you have any questions, just email me. Thank you. Bye-bye.